The Vatican Library will open its doors again on September 20th after three years of intense remodeling. The scaffolding and workers will leave their post to books and scholars who will find a more modern library with a better security system. The main objective of the remodeling was to improve security in the library to prevent theft or loss. Books will be registered in an electronic system and will contain an identification chip from now on. The volume is identified. Each book is identified by a computer code, a tag with an electronic chip. Then, according to the user, there may be places accessible or forbidden depending on the volume and the person who takes the book. With the new system, the library will always know who has the books, where they are, and the path taken in the library. It also prevents the person from taking an unavailable volume or from taking it to unauthorized areas or out of the library. Security arches and cameras have been installed in every room. You cannot leave the library with a book because there are a number of alarms, and in some cases, security arches blocking the exit. According to the director, the security measures were not made because of a theft. The library only wants to better preserve its nearly 1.6 million volumes and 150,000 manuscripts. Besides the security measures, a new elevator has been built to move manuscripts in a more secure way and to improve the entrance of the more than 150 scholars who come to the library each day. An updated library will unite the latest technologies and ancient works, such as a 4th century Bible, two manuscripts of Virgil, and the Divine Comedy painted by Boccaccio. It's a place where scholars from around the world can again reference one-of-a-kind works.